I don't care that I look like shit and that my voice sounds like crap. Um, I'm not going to do much talking in this video. And I'm just going to do this. There we go. Um, here's what's going to happen. I'm not going to do much talking today because I was at the bar last night singing to the point of no return. And I scratched out my voice to fucking hell. So, um... I have found a new love, and I'm in love with soy milk. I have no idea why I, it, my doctors, like, as I told you guys prior, I'm going to put my hair up, because this, as much as I love this, I, yeah. Um, my doctor told me I'm no longer to have dairy products. Basically, I'm not, I'm not allowed to eat anything that's good, to include anything like dairy and cheeses and, Like a bunch of different things. And because of that, I've had to really um, change my, my regimen with tea and so many different things and so many things that I need to eat. And it was, it's hard. It is hard. And I've lost about, I was a size 16 to 20, I think, around those lines. And I dropped from 16 to, uh, to uh, 10. And uh, it's all because of this doctor diet. I've been eating nothing but rice and fish and sushi. A little bit of arroz con pollo. Because I, I, if I had to give a up, if I had to give up arroz con pollo, there'd be fucking issues. Um, and uh, yeah, it's just a bunch of different things. Um, I'm so super happy. And, uh, it's actually, I've, I've never, I haven't been, like, a size 10, uh, since freshman year of college. <laughs> so, and that's, like, almost 10 years ago. Um, oh my god, my eyeballs. Uh, yeah, so, me and my girl, I went food shopping with a few friends, and, with my cousin. Like, this was, like, two weeks ago. And he's like, why don't you try soy milk? I'm like, because I'd rather shoot myself. He goes, you can't have dairy anymore. I'm like, alright, fine. So we went to the supermarket. We were making dinner anyway. And he's like, why don't you try silk? It's the most advertised. Maybe you'll like it. I'm like, alright, fine. What's the harm in tr not trying it? I fucking love this shit. I'm going to finish it, and I'm going to try silk almond, but I do like soy milk, and it's, it has, it's a weird, it's a weird tasting at first, but it's oddly good, and I didn't think I would like it, but I mean, I gotta get healthy, and my body needs to be better than it was, so, I mean, I'm, I feel a lot more healthier, I'm eating things that I would never eat in a million years, and I'm trying different, and, and it's good, I used to be very close off to food, which is crazy, anyone who knows me, I eat anything in sight. And, um, no, totally. I, I want to try different things because I don't want to be closed off for to shit forever. Alright, I'm rambling. Um, I am going to a deaf event tonight. I'm not going to Guido's. I'm going to see Keith Wan in Lexington, Lexington School for the Deaf in, uh, in Queens, Jackson Heights. I am so stoked for this. Because he is a comedian I've been wanting to see for so long. He's a coda, a child of deaf adults. Which which means his parents are deaf, but he's hearing. A deafness is a generation each. So I'm just really fucking stoked. Alright, I'm going to go. But I just wanted to give you guys some love. I haven't made up video in two days. And vlog every day in May is going to happen. So, peace.